Ito ang Pilipinas ngayon. Moderno at may makabago na din suliranin. Sa harap ng samot-saring problemang pangkabuhayan at panlipunan na kinakaharap ng ating bansa at mga kababayan, Ilan pa ba kaya sa ating mga Pilipino ang naiintindihan o nakakaalala pa sa kahalagahan ng isang yugto sa ating kasaysayan na naging simbolo ng ating kalayaan at pagiging isang tunay na Pilipino? What do you know about the death march? We're asked to walk to march from Tarlac. No, are going to What do you know of the death march? Be truthful. <laughs> ano po alam niyo sa death march? Siyempre po, parang bitay. <laughs> parang bitay na sa atin. Ano po alam niyo sa death march? Yun nga po, hindi ko alam eh. At ako po magtatanong ano po yun, death march. <laughs> Masakit mang isipin na maliban na lamang sa ating mga veterano at nakakatandang henerasyon, Nakakaunti na lang o halos wala nang nalalabi pa sa mga bago nating mga mamamayan ang interesado o kaya may alam sa mga pangyayari sa ating kasaysayan gaya ng Bataan Death March. At kung tutuusin, mas alam pa ng karamihan ng ating kabataan at mamamayan ang mga pangalan ng artista na gumaganap sa pantaserye, sa sine at telebisyon. Sino artista sa palos? Siyempre ho, si Cesar Montano, may idol. <laughs> Sige po, salamat po. Patay na nga ba sa puso ng bawat Pilipino ang damdamin ng patriotismo? Bataan, matagal ko nang gustong gawin. Uh, two years ago pa, uh, matag matagal ko nang gustong gawin yan. Ever since siguro... We did that uh, trip to Mount Samat, and I thought, you know, that's a hundred kilometers, and might be something if I ran that death march route. Um, when I went to the internet, the when I when I used the search word uh, Bataan Death March, I found the death march run. But it was in New Mexico, USA, and it was organized by the American military, uh, the veterans in America. Sa pagtakbo ni Bet ng rota ng Bataan Death March, halos naramdaman niya ang hirap na dinaanan ng ating mga bayani. Nihirapan ako nun eh. Uh, you know, in the last, maybe in the last 20 kilometers, your body starts to really, you really feel the pain. Na. Um, your chest is painful, your shoulders are painful, your back is painful, and uh, your feet hurt. Your feet hurt because uh, you know that you have blisters, and your blisters are bleeding. Tapos, uh, may blisters ka pa sa ibang parts, and then, Yung, yung balat mo, masakit na kasi yung pawis, you know, the, the clothing rubs on your skin and then it causes uh, rashes. So masakit na masakit na. I would like to raise awareness uh, for, ano, for the Bataan heroes, for what happened in Bataan. And maybe in doing so, raise awareness and appreciation for Philippine history in general. Ang Bataan kasi, it's Philippine history eh. It's a big part of our history. Um, it's a whole generation of Filipino men and women who sacrificed their lives for this country. This is my 
my heritage. Eh. It's every Filipino's heritage and it's every Filipino's uh, duty to upheld and honor those who have fallen to give this country its uh, independence.